in Bixby, where the OSBI is now in charge of the investigation involving multiple football players. To work to you, reporter Katie Wisely joins us with some new information from an anonymous source. It's a nightmare for everybody involved. An alleged incident has opened the door to the rumor mill in Bixby. It's still a difficult topic. After a police report was filed on November 9th. My heart breaks for, for the alleged victim. And I got to tell you, these, these alleged perpetrators, even if they're found to be not guilty, it's, it's going to be a very difficult time for them. The report says the incident happened on November 2nd. An anonymous source tells Two Works For You the alleged incident did not happen at a football event, but rather at an informal gathering of football players. The source claims a group of players were roughhousing. I have some understanding of, of how sensitive the, the subject is. The police report accuses rape by instrumentation. Anything from a finger to a yardstick. Of all the things that can happen to a person short of being killed. The anonymous source says the Bixby football coach removed multiple players from the team, addressing a no bullying policy 23 days ago, but did not address the specific incident. The source says two of those players were starters and have not played in games for the last three weeks. Whatever the allegations are, nobody's been found guilty of anything yet. A second anonymous source tells Two Works For You the victim's parent works for the district attorney's office. The office released this statement on Tuesday saying our office would necessarily recuse itself from review of any investigation if it is determined that a victim is connected to a member of our staff. It's a very serious charge and and something that's going to have lifelong impact for both the the alleged perpetrators even if they're proven to be not guilty and of course the victim. The case is still being investigated and at this point no arrests have been made. Karen, back to you. Thank you.